Hey, what's going on, YouTube? It's the Scorpion with Mikkel. He is finally back on the show. And, you know, we're going to be talking about a little bit of entertainment news. First, I want to say thank you to everyone who has subscribed to the show. We now have 8,300 subscribers. And thank you so much. And keep telling everybody about the Scorpion Show. Get the word out. If somebody's at your house watching the show right now, had them create a YouTube account, had them subscribe to that. Now, Rihanna is going to be performing in Dubai for the first time since January. She will be performing in, did I say Dubai? Yeah. I said that. Okay. Yeah. She's returning back to the stage, so I want to say congratulations to Rihanna. Also, you know, Chris Brown has an apology song out, and I want to know, do y'all like the song? Have you heard it? No, I, no. It's all right. You know, he apologizing about for the things that he did, but it's like... Is he apologizing for it? That specific incident, where she just apologized. Oh, 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 he apologized to Rihanna. Oh, song. for that. Oh, I have to listen to it. Yes, you gotta hear it. It's it's kind of it's heartfelt, and you know, I think that they're doing a lot of damage control because I done seen the pictures with Chris Brown taking pictures with girls Damn. in public and babies. He ain't the president. But, but, are they doing damage control a little bit too late? Because when you think about it. That whole incident, people are tired of hearing about it, and it's also out of people's minds now. If you notice, nobody talks about it anymore. Yeah. So are they doing it a little bit too late? Should, um, they, should they have been doing damage control while it was still I mean, what, what fresh could you do? Mind? No, because then everybody would have tried to, try to slap him and <laughs> curse him out in public. <laughs> doing it it got to die down, you know? Things got to die down. Huh. Well, let's just put it like this. I personally don't think that either one of their careers will ever be the same again. That's why, if you notice... This incident happened back in Jan. Wait, when was the Grammys? February? February. February. Two months ago. Two months ago. For the past two months, what has Rihanna been doing? Nothing but partying. Mm -hmm. We see her at club. We've been seeing her at clubs over and over again. Then we've been seeing her in Hawaii. Then we've been seeing She's her been in New York. Having dinner with Jay-Z, Beyonce, and Brandy for her birthday. We've seen her in Barbados. We've seen her in with Florida. her family in Florida. But we haven't seen her singing or performing anywhere. Why? Because she's trying to get herself back out there. That's what she's trying to do. First of all, she's doing what she's known for doing anyway, which is looking pretty. Mm -hmm. I mean, that's the only thing she's really good at doing anyway. <gasps> so, <laughs> now that trying. she's out there, now that she's gotten her image back out there, now that we all remember her for the Rihanna that she was before, what was it, February February 10th, 10th or 11th? 11th. Before, one of those damn days. Yeah, one of those damn days we just got to ask for. <laughs> now that we recognize her as the Rihanna before that, now it's time for her to hit the stage again. So now in May, she's going to be performing. So that'll be almost four months then. Yeah, it'll be almost four months since she hit the stage. Um, I, I just can't wait to hear a new album from her. You know, I, I, I can't wait to hear a new album. Like, you don't like her because she's not a... But no, I don't, no, it's not that I don't like her. I, well, why don't you like her? I don't like her because I feel as though there are twice as many people out there that are way more talented than she is. Like myself. But yet, she's only popular because of her whole image. Because remember, when Pondy River came out, I'm sure I wasn't the only one that thought that she was going to be a one-hit wonder. Mm -hmm. Just like but, me in the sky and them. And then Luma D. Because you know, every little summer, they, they had that little one little rhythm song, mm -hmm. and everybody was yeah. into it, then they just And then they just disappeared. But... Somebody got a hold of Rihanna. I don't know who her stylist is, but her stylist got a hold of her. Cut the hair up. Cha -cha 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 -ting. Put the right nice makeup on her face to make her look lighter. Cha -cha 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 -ting. Put her in the hottest clothes out there. The baddest shoes out there. And what do you have? A fashion icon. But but Fifi Dobson was doing the rocker thing before. But Rihanna. it's not. But see, but, then, but see, you know, but see, you're, but see, was getting caught but up see, with see, you're the, naming people. You but see, like you're naming. Amber but no, Green. listen, you're naming people uh, that. Look, you listen, you're naming people. You again. You're naming people that majority of our viewers don't really. No, no. But they they yeah. should have. But, but see, they identify more with people like Rihanna. 
You know why they identify with her now? Because, like you said before, now music is turning into this whole big pop sensation. And now we have somebody like Rihanna that actually kind of looks like us mm -hmm. with the dark skin. Fifi Dobson, what is she, white? She was black. She's black. Oh, well. She was black. What's, what's the name like Fifi? She, Phoebe, she needs to be well, white. Well, she's Canadian. So, I mean. Uh, uh, ding, 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 ding. I mean, ain't nothing wrong with that. Fifi. Stop Fifi. That. That's sure. about Felicia or something, you know? Fifi. Hey, Fifi. Fifi is something okay. that. You know what a Fifi is in jail? I don't want to know. Mm. I'm, I don't know when you don't want to go to jail. Okay. Let me tell you something. If you know what a Fifi is in jail, please hit Kevin up to let, to let him know. I don't, why they got to hit me up? You hit McCullough. Because I know what it is. Hit McCullough on Twitter.com. No, I, I, I know what it is. I know what it is. But... <laughs> Woo! I don't know what a Fifi is. And please don't nobody ask me how do I know what that is. Mm, now, Brandy, now everybody getting these little TV shows. Oh Brandy got a TV show. Monica already had a TV show getting them on BT. Fantasia getting a reality show on VH1. And Keisha Knight Pulliam is getting a, a um, reality show on Oxygen. Who, now, first of all, I'm not knocking nobody's us on getting a reality show. But Keisha Knight Pulliam, now you need to stop. <laughs> Now, this is a bi girl, fly girl <laughs> moment. Keisha! Keisha! Girl! We know you as Rudy, because that's what you're known for, as Rudy. <laughs> then you went on the view. I don't like it when people call me Rudy. Ah, uh, like she it. said she liked it. But wait yeah, but then she said, then she said she likes it. Wait, wait, wait. I mean, uh, uh, look. Look, and I understand when, when, when some, because what her thing was, when she was saying, if you listen to the interview, what her thing was, she's done way more stuff other than Ru other than the Cosby, which is understandable, but she'll always be famous for Rudy, so. Not unless she do a role that make people forget. Just like Brandy will always be famous for Moesha, because if you don't ever remember Brandy's name, you're going to always remember Moesha. Now, to be honest with you, I don't look, when I see Brandy, I don't say Moesha. No, when I no, see listen, Brandy, but I say some Brandy. people, like for instance, for, for instance, some people's parents. I'm just saying parents, because us young people, we know Brandy. But some, like, like for instance, like my mom. Mm -hmm. My mom is the type of person, my mom is horrible with names, but she'll know what you played in. Mm -hmm. You know, oh, he was that guy that played in that movie, or she was that guy that did that, that TV show. You know, some older people might say, oh, yeah, Moesha. But what is her name? What is her name? Brandy. Oh, yeah, Brandy. What's her name? Oh, she might be real old. Like, no, she's not real old. But like, for instance, some old people, for instance, my coworker. Every time she mentions Brandy's brother, she always says RJ. I'll be like, Ray J. Ray J. Not RJ. Ray J. But you know how old people, they know who they're talking about, mm -hmm. but they just get it backwards. So some people may remember Brandy as what we But I mean, okay, now, whatever. Whatever. Do you really want to be known for a character that you played, or do you want to be known as Mikkel? Because I kind of feel bad, because on Martin, we don't say Tashina Arnold. Her <laughs> name is Ben. <laughs> We say Tommy, well, Tommy, that's his real name, so Tommy. And Tina. Yeah. I don't care that she been on, what was that Tina. show? Where I've been on, uh, for the love, for no, my, my wife and kids. kids. I don't care about what's her name on that. She we don't even know her name. What's her name on I don't know. <laughs> she will always know. be Gina. But it's right. always, forever, be Gina. Even when you see her on school days, way before, yes. way before Mark even came out, you're like, oh yeah, look oh, at yeah, Gina. Gina. She was on there, oh my God, I didn't even know. Ooh, Pam in there too, look at Pam. Oh, you know why? But see, Martin is the only one out of that TV show that actually had it good, because his name was Martin. So, but I think that if you have a character like that, that really, really, people just loved and loved and like, it was just a popular thing. I don't have anything wrong with that. Like the Cosby shows, that Cosby show was like a historic television yes, show. And they still getting paid. And they still the getting paid. Cosby come on 4 o'clock in the morning, 5 o'clock, yeah. TV land, and all that. They still getting paid. So, yes, you know, yeah. I, I, would, I would, hey, call me Rudy all you want. Okay. But Keisha, congratulations on getting your show, but... But the show, I, but you gotta tell boy? the people about the show. It's, it's tell going, them about the show. It's going to be based on her, 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 her boy, boyfriend. Her fiance, actually. Oh, okay, fiance. But here's the trick question. Who's her fiance? Shit, that's not a quick trick question. That's who the hell is he? I want to know. But here's another question. Do we care? Who cares? <laughs> uh, I'll let you guys think about this. Y'all being shady. Okay. No, really, who <laughs> cares? Who is actually, like, we'll probably watch one or two episodes and then we'll be like, okay, whatever. You know, okay. like, who cares? That now, for a Fantasia reality show, oh my God. I would only watch it if she was in the studio, like, recording, because I don't, I don't think I want to know what, what, what they be doing all the time. You know why? 
Fantasia oh. show is not going to be that popular because even though Fant to us, well, not to some of us, Fantasia has that whole ghetto image. Mm -hmm. But when you really look at her family, they're not really. I mean, they. They're not that. They're actually church people. Mm -hmm. They're nothing like Keisha Cole's family. So I think that'll be the turn off because we look at it. We don't and, even know. But see, no, but uh, yeah, we, you're right. We don't know. But they come off as this image as church, holy, sanctified people, which is mm -hmm. good. Whereas mm -hmm. though Keisha Cole's family just comes off as ghetto, mm -hmm. and they're ghetto as hell. But see, I think when people look at Fantasia, they're gonna see her image as, oh yeah, she's ghetto. So it, it may be like Keisha Cole's fa family. So I'm going to watch. And then once they watch, and when they realize it's nothing like that, then they're going to be turned off by it, and the people are going to stop watching it. Well, of course, it's probably going to be some drama added on to the show. Like, I will... Now, you know what I will want to see, though? How is the interaction between her and her daughter's father? I don't want to say baby father, baby well, mom, baby daddy, and all I, that. I don't know. I, don't I don't even know, know if they still... Because you know after what he put her through, I don't even know if they still talk. Yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm pretty sure they do. Like, I would, I would want to see how their relationship is that way. I want to know about her struggling when she had that... Uh, Tumor? Not, was it a tumor? It was something. It was a brain tumor. No, not oh brain. no, it not brain. brain it, over it, I'm throat. sorry. Why did I no, say I want to know tumor. about all of that. So you know, it might be good. I'm sorry. Now, Brandy, doesn't he look like Bobby Valentino? He really does. And this looks fake. It looked like they photoshopped his yeah. face. But his past we didn't even want to promote this party. No. But uh, no, 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 no not. not. Okay. Now Brandy got a show on ABC of all channels, and it's called This Little Piggy. And you know, I'm hoping that it works out for Brandy because musically, I, I I don't think Brandy cares anymore. It's like, here's my music, it's out, bye girl, fly girl. Whatever. Like, I'm like, Brandy, you ain't even coming out with no more singles. We ain't get a single since October. I don't I don't think they heart just don't be into it no more. Some of them. If you wanna sing, Not put your heart Some into it. Some of them. What shit? Can I just say something yeah. since we're on singles right now? Okay, so you know, today on Twitter, which Kevin and I will go to a little later in the show. But today on Twitter, I was posting some of our um, our old videos, like our old videos. And one of the videos that I posted was of me and you singing um, Free. Remember mm -hmm. we were singing Free over there and we were just into it? Well, I thought it would be a good idea to send that video to Michelle Williams. Because you know Michelle Williams is our friend on MySpace and she has us on her top friends. And so, and she's following us on and Twitter. And she's following us on Twitter. So, <laughs> eat your heart out, haters. Mm -hmm. Um, and so I sent her that message today. Now you know, usually when you send something to Michelle, she takes forever in a day to respond mm -hmm. back. <laughs> well, do you know? I got a response back probably less than an hour. Mm -hmm. And she left me a message, and I'll let you read the message. But she's, I think she started off by saying that, like, I'm not, I don't, I'm not gonna really call her because I'm not for sure, like word for word, but she started out by saying that every time she watches that particular performance or hears them sing that song, she always gets teary-eyed because she said the part where they were doing a performance on a DVD and they all huddled up and were singing together, she said in the message that that part always got all three of them emotional because all three of them would know which each one was going through in their life. So that would always get them emotional. And she said every time she watches it, she gets teary-eyed to know that every time they would sing it, it was always called for And I was just like, oh my God, look what I started! <laughs> and then she told me like this little bit of information that I, like, ah! I want a book. Okay, I need to do a book together. I but I was so book. happy. So now, and I told her, I don't know if anybody knows this, and I don't know if I ever told you, but Free is actually my favorite Destiny's Child song of all the songs that they ever came out with. Free is such a decent song. And one of my MySpace friends is shame on you, and he knows who he is, and I'm not going to put him on blast, but he didn't even know Free. So I don't want to hear it. He didn't no, even no, know no, it. No, 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 get up out of here. But when she told me that she said that, and I, I mean, that part when she said that, because you know what part I'm talking about, when they hug each other, mm -hmm. they just be saying, she said that part always got all three of them emotions, because all, if, if one of them was going through something, they would all know. And then it was, I was just like, oh my God. So, Michelle, I'm sorry if I got you a little teary eyed today, but I just thought it was something I, nice that I'd share with you. And thank you, girl, for writing me back, because you'll be taking forever to write people back. I uh, know. You write her on my space. You better write her on Twitter. Oh, I oh I didn't write her on Twitter, but I but I sure was excited when she accepted, when I found out she was following me. I was like, ah! And thanks for the phone call yesterday, Michelle. Thank you so much. Girl, girl, I, I, <laughs> Michelle, that's some shady stuff, girl, because you know I gave you my... <laughs> Oh, you gave her your number? I sure did. 
But you probably didn't answer a block number then. No, I yeah. answer block numbers because my phone, my phone at my house, my house phone when my mom calls, it comes up as blocked, so I have to answer because I don't know if it's my mom or not. But my friend, so one of my friends said, "Well, how come when he called, when she called him, he don't never call you?" Let me tell you. I said he needs to. I said you damn right he it needs to. When, when that's Michelle you call on the me, phone. No, because you call me any other damn time when somebody else is on the phone. <laughs> when Michelle's on the phone, fuck everybody else. Look, I'm like, hey, God, what's going on? Yes. <laughs> Michelle, who? Who? <laughs> I ain't worried about no damn account. He will call me any other time when somebody else is on the phone. I'll be like, oh my God, what do you want? You need to do that to me one day while she's on the phone. And then I not know it. I'll be like, oh my God, who is it? Like, and just like, oh my God. I'm like, oh God, Kevin, whoever this is that you have pretending to be Michelle, she can kiss my ass. <laughs> oh my God. <laughs> Some girl tried it. You know what? The rest of that shit we got on this is ain't even worth talking. No. <laughs> Jamie Foxx. Yeah. Jamie Foxx. Jamie. Oh now you I need to stop. I thought they were Because you know what, Jamie? Who that? Who? Uh, name, uh-uh. You got a number? Uh-uh. We in the middle of doing something, sweetheart. <laughs> I mean, if you leave me your number, I can, um... If you leave me your number, I can, um... Did you stop it? When she come home. I ain't the oldest. I'm not Nina's. I'm not Nina's. Uh, this is Nina's brother. brother. This is Nina's brother. I'm the brother. Mm-hmm. I'm the. Can you do me a favor on the computer real quick? Mm-hmm. What? <laughs>